As long as I've been in marketing, there's been always a fight that, you know, maybe marketing's not as important. And I do think that tide's shifting, especially with the onset of digital. Companies are understanding that they can make $1 spend like two or three or four. And so they're more willing to invest, I've seen in the past couple of years versus 10 years ago. In 2023, the hardest situation that all marketers are facing is identifying the right audience and then meeting them when they're open to receiving your brand messaging. So really finding who those people are is something we know, but where they are and when they're open to to engaging with us and making that meaningful impression is what we're really after. How to find new audiences while keeping the consent and losing a lot of that third-party data. Really get crisp on your objectives and your key performance indicators. Really sticking to what your objectives are, what the goals are numerically, and checking in on those goals quarterly to make sure you're on track for what you want to deliver by the end of the year. There's so many data points available to find out about our audiences and what they like and their consuming and purchasing behaviors. So just tailoring like marketing directly towards that as much as possible is the way forward. Be more strategic about your approach. And before you actually spend your money, do research and development. The idea of weathering the storm and doubling down on a loyal audience, listening to them where they are, making sure that your you know, campaigns, your meaning behind everything you're putting out is aligning to where consumers' wallets are. My prediction is that we're going to expand, like as an industry, expand um, more innovatively into measurement of like mass channels. I think like with the CTV and digital eco space as a, as a whole, I think a lot more companies are going to be shifting a lot more budget towards that. Where we're kind of placing our bets is um, connected TV and streaming TV. So I think that's going to be a good way for brands to get that top of funnel awareness and then connect it to the rest of their marketing initiatives. I think that demand will actually continue to rise even though there's all these signs of a recession. I don't think demand is going to slow down. Regardless of whatever year it is, things will always be uncertain. So just keep pushing and keep thriving. And if we do go through economic downturn, that means there's less competition People have taken their foot off the gas, so just go harder. I think it's gonna get crowded. The need to stand out is more prevalent than ever. People are going to continue to narrow down where they spend their time and spend more time in those places. So rather than being a brand that is everywhere for everyone, I no longer feel like that is really what a brand should be attracting, but finding a home uh, and building a community in that one or singular or several, you know, deeper places rather than just being like the first to try it all.